So hey guys, welcome back to my channel for tutorials. So guys, today I'll teach you how to create new and cool motion graphic text animation in Cinema 4D. See guys, that's my really cool effect. It's really simple. Okay, so guys, now I teach you how I create this type of effect. So firstly guys, I'm going to take a text tool, this one, and type your letter. So I type like a W, yeah, and guys, alignment, middle, and change font. So guys, font, I like bold and thick, like this, yeah. So guys, go to on display, select God shading lines, and now guys, I increase depth. So depth, I like 30 centimeters good for me. And next one, I use Rodney Fracture tool. So guys, select your text and make child with Rodney Fracture. Okay, so now, guys, go click on here. And that's my point, point height. So I increase this point amount like uh, 2000. Randomly, 2000 is good. And guys, distribution type, I use normal. I like this one, right? That's my shape. Okay, so guys, select this Rodney Fracture and little bit up like this yeah and guys this time you can change this standard this one like a 0 0.2 is good and guys i increase this point like a 3000 yeah much better right okay see guys that's my standard i like 0 0.2 and point amount 3000 is good and high quality check so guys next one i take plane and increase plane size like a 1000 1000 and guys segments I like one and one yeah great okay so now guys next one select your Rodney fracture and guys go to our more graph and use this time here random effector tool okay so guys go to one field and I like this one spherical field check and I change size like a 25 enter yeah that's my size and guys now go to on front view panel so guys i change guys go to on here that's my frame like a 350 and guys select your spherical field little bit up like this select guys basic here and like a 26 and position check so guys now go to like a 200 frames and position go to an up like this like a 250 and check yes and go to back and play yeah okay so guys now i change graph editor so guys go to one window and timeline f curve tool so guys select your graph so guys select and use liner check and again play yeah good right see guys that's my simple effect good okay so guys now next one i apply one more this one spherical field random okay so guys now select your rony fracture and guys go to on here effector random so guys go to on here select this random effector okay i will change and guys i like same spherical field so guys scale size like a 25 and position change so guys select this spherical field so position change like this and guys all is good okay so guys same go to on here and i create same position animation so guys p like a minus 60 and i like zero and p check guys same go to on 200 frames so up like this yeah like a same 250 and check yes so guys go to back and play okay so guys same select your second spherical field and timeline f curve tool select and line a check and guys select and line a check yes so guys go to back and play yeah right 
ओके सो गाइस नेक्स्ट वन आई लाइक वन मोर स्पेरिकल फील्ड आई अप्लाई वन मोर सो स्टॉप गो टू बैक सेलेक्ट अगेन रॉनी फ्रैक्चर एंड गाइस गो टू अर मोग्राफ सो आई लाइक सेम रैंडम इफेक्टर सो गाइस स्पेरिकल फील्ड चेक एंड गाइस आई विल चेंज पोजीशन एंड स्केल साइज 25 25 चेक सो गो टू ऑन हियर एंड गाइस सेलेक्ट योर स्पेरिकल फील्ड yeah like a 70 is good and position check so guys same 200 frames and go to an up like this like a 240 and check so guys select and i apply liner so liner check okay so guys all is good that's my simple animation and play yeah wait see guys that's my simple dynamic effect right okay so guys next one i apply rigid body tag so stop so guys select your fracture and right click go to on simulation tag and i apply rigid body so guys now firstly that's my dynamic and tiger i use at a velocity peak check and go to on here so guys bounce this one bounce are like 0.1 and friction are like 1 right that's my friction 1 and bounce 0.1 and thickness i like 1 cm yes okay so guys play guys take little bit time because that's my heavy effect right see guys that's my really cool dynamic effect and guys now stop so guys i apply collision tag on this plane so guys select this plane and i apply collision tag so guys bounce i like 0.1 and guys friction I like one, actually one. Yes. Okay. So guys, again this time, select your Ronnie fracture, and that's my rigid body tech and catch it. And guys, see that's my catch it screen check. Okay. So guys, my baking is finished. Now go to back and play. That's my simple Ronnie fracture tool, and guys. change little bit yeah see guys that's my really cool dynamic effect right it's looking really beautiful okay so guys also i create one more animation that's my first effect and guys stop guys my text is really great and guys now select this one and catch a clear catch a check so guys now select your tag here that's my dynamic effect So guys I go to like a 250 frame So guys go to on 250 Yeah that's my 250 frame and see guys that's my trigger check Guys increase one frame like a 251 and guys see that's my velocity peak change to immediately and trigger check yes that's it guys right that's my simple animation guys one more time I will repeat 250 frame That's my at a velocity peak check, and guys go to on here two five one and trigger use immediately, right? Okay, so guys now one more time go to on here fracture, and guys select your dynamic tag rigid body tag and catch a scene check. Okay, so guys play. Yeah, that's my first effect. Yeah, okay, see guys, that some part is not collide, so don't worry. So stop, go to back, and guys, clear catch it check. Guys, I increase this size, so guys, select this one, spherical field. So guys, I increase size like a twenty six. Yes, and guys, select this one, third one, select second, spherical field check. Okay, so now guys, select this tag and go to on here. Guys, bounce little bit increase like a zero point two, and guys, select this one plane. That's my flow, and guys, go to on here. Bounce, guys, I like zero point zero, and friction I like two. Yes, great. Okay, so now guys, select this brawny fracture, and guys, point amount increase like a. Three two double zero, 
and guys number of seat randomly check right that's my number of seat randomly change and guys go to on here standard i like 0 0.22 okay see guys that's my change some setting and one more time guys go to on here rigid body tech and catch a scene check and guys my baking is finished now guys final work see guys that's my really cool final effect right it's looking really beautiful yes great okay so guys my final work is finished so stop and guys now i take camera so guys you can change render setting like a standard and use ambient occlusion global illumination and t select best so guys i take camera and camera check guys set your camera angle is dependent on your work yeah this camera angle is good for me so guys lock this camera lock camera lock and guys this time i apply material so guys go to on create and load material guys i have cinema 4d studio light so select and select material yeah so guys select this one i like that's my yellow material and second one i like red material so guys select your brownie fracture and object and colorize fragment uncheck okay so guys now play okay so guys see that's not inner part so now guys go to back so go to on here selection and inside face and that's my outside face check so guys again play okay so guys select this one so guys select your red material and that's my outside yeah right see guys that's my material and guys select your this one yellow material and drag and drop like this inside yes and guys play see guys that's my beautiful work and beautiful material and i will apply this time cinema 4d studio light so select yes and guys see that's my lighting so guys camera uncheck so guys go to back select your overhead soft box and go to on mid so guys go to on here like this yes great and guys play and guys go to on camera also guys you can adjust your flow so guys closer and little bit up like this yes great right see guys that's my flow alignment and guys play yes okay so guys my work is finished it's looking really beautiful and go to on back so guys click on here render and play yes okay so guys my work is finished that's my final work so guys if you like my video please share and please subscribe my youtube channel thank you